day, it's Pete here and I'm back for the weekly free instant tournament. This is an 8 board BBO tournament that you can play by clicking solitaire bridge and then weekly free. Uh, let's just jump straight into it and see what we can do. Alright, so first hand I got a 15 count and I've opened my long suit. So this is a really interesting spot. Um, so first of all, my normal action is just to pass. Yes, I've got 15 points. Yes, I would have opened, but I don't have a legitimate bid I can make. I, I can't double because if partner bids spades, that's terrible. Um, I don't have a five card suit to overcall. Um, the one bid I am considering is actually bidding a no trump. Now, that would say I've got 15 to 18 points and a balanced hand, at least two cards in all the suits. So I don't have a balanced hand. I don't have two spades. But when does that actually work badly? And is it worth the risk? So when does bidding one no trump work badly is that my partner transfers to spades and passes and I can't make it or something like that. Um, it's also bad when partner's got six spades and we get to four spades rather than three no trumps. But I really don't think my partner's got six spades. That, they've, they've passed here. So... Basically, the bad time is when partner is a weak hand with five spades. Other than that, if they use stamen, we don't end up in two spades. If they pass, we're okay. Benefits of bidding one no trump here is maybe we get to three no trumps or one no trump. Um, maybe play in hearts. Um, it also preempts the opponents out of spades. It makes it a bit tougher for them. So I kind of like one no trump here. It's... Like, pass is fine. It's a bit dubious, but let's give it a shot. Double penalties, redouble. I have a long minor. Pitable diamonds. Alright, so what's going on here? Uh, my partner has five clubs and probably short diamonds. West has a penalty double. Now, there are a lot of mages out there. I am tempted to try and bid three clubs. Now, obviously, I'd like to defend two diamonds because we've got two diamonds, a club, a heart, and I can probably start forcing them. But I suspect that West will try bidding something like two spades. And if I bid three clubs now, it might put them under the pump so that they can't. Um, and, like, keep them out of their spade fit. My partner doesn't have five spades for this action. They have a spade fit. Three clubs looks like it'll keep them out of it. Now, this looks really, really silly because they were trying to play in diamond, but I kind of suspect that they were going to get out of it. Three hearts. Biddable hearts. Four hearts. Right. Wow. Okay, so they found a heart fit here. They made hard work of this. Are, are they making this? My partner's got, like, very little. But if I just draw trumps, they're probably going to run spades. I'll pass. Okay. Like, I suspect that they can draw trumps and set up spades. If that's the case, maybe I should start a forcing defense, try and... Um, force them into roughing, which means that maybe they lose control. Alternatively, I could lead a diamond, which then I get in with the ace of hearts, and I get to give my partner a diamond rough most of the time, but they might have to over rough. It looks like my partner's got two hearts, probably four spades, or else there are a lot of spades missing. So, like, maybe there are four, two, two, five. This is all pretty awkward. East has a singleton club very, very often. I'm going to try and lead the ace of clubs. Does it get roughed? Yeah, it gets roughed. Okay. So, all right. Dummy has nine points, and they're starting to draw trumps. So it doesn't look like the drawing trumps approach is going to work. Heart to my jack. Ten of spades and they win the queen. So. 
East could be a 6-5 potentially. If East is a 6-5, what's that give them? They've got... Um, oh, that, my, they can now finesse my partner's nine of spades. Alright. Oh, like roughing finesse my partner's nine of spades. I could go up with the ace of hearts and play a heart. Um, I think going up with the ace of hearts is good. I don't want to be stranded with just that. They're obviously going to play another, like a heart to the king. I can't see, couldn't see them running the seven of hearts when I had the eight. It just wouldn't make sense. So here, East has six diamonds and four hearts. They had four little hearts here that they managed to bid. Uh, so if they've got ace, queen, doubleton, spade, they might have entry issues. I could, if I play another club here, they still have to draw my trump, which prevents them roughing that. So let's come out the queen of clubs here. If they pitched a spade. So dummy is all good at this stage. So it looks like leading my singleton spade would have worked. 25%. Um, because my partner gets in, do they? But they can always do it. Like they just play heart to the king, heart out. Which doesn't work, but... <laughs> Everyone's in four spades. I was the only one that mangled up the auction. So if you pass a spade, two diamonds. Why they don't bid their hearts here, I don't know. Um, but four spades only has 10 tricks. Some people managed to beat that. Like, I, I'm impressed that they got to hearts and East came in with three hearts in that spot. How do we go in clubs? Uh, so we lose a spade, a heart, a club, the ace of diamonds, and probably a rough, so down too many. But I thought I did a decent job at making life tough for them. Um, didn't work out in the end. I was happy that I got them to hearts, but it turns out hearts is actually a better spot for them. If I lead the jack of spades, they win, they play a heart to the nine, my partner might give me a rough, and then we hold them to ten, and I maybe get 64%. Maybe I should have tried that. I still thought trying to force them was, was a decent idea. Because um, leading the jack of spades needs my partner to be able to get in. So it's pretty rich. But maybe I can do something like under leader club. Okay. Anyway. Uh, 10, 14 points. Balanced hand. 5 card suits. I'll upgrade it into a no trump. 2 spades. 4 spades. Alright. So my partner's got a four triple three. We have a club loser. We have a heart loser, and potentially a spade. Um, so it just looks like win and yeah, just a spade to the ace, spade to the king. See if they break. They do. So next is, is there any way to get rid of this heart loser? No, unless they give me a rough and disc, uh, not heart loser, the club loser. Unless they give me a rough and discard. Um, which isn't going to happen. Oh, they, they found it. Um, So, uh, plus one for a flat board. 53%. That is a generous 3% there. Uh, no matter what you do, you get to four spades. Someone got to three no. One no, two no, three no. Balanced sub-maximum. That seems like a reasonable bid. 
Um, and I've got five spades. Ah, oh, the opponents have to lead a club here. And they do. <laughs> Punished. All right. Um, next board, 12 points. Best hand tournament. Uh, it just looks like opening a diamond, a spade, or a bit of no trump. Uh, my partner's saying, do I have three card support? Or oh, like, you might have four things, so four spades. All right. Uh, diamond lead, and now we have, so we've got two heart losers, two heart losers and a diamond. I can throw, I can throw two hearts away. So I can throw two hearts away. On my diamonds, so I just have to guess hearts. Um, so East led the ace of ace of diamonds, which is kind of a weird lead. Um, let's just catch the ace of spades. And I want as much information as possible uh, here before I make this choice. So Basically, my entry to the south hand is the king of spades. So I'm thinking club to the ace, rough a club. Uh, queen of spades, spade to my hand. King, jack of diamonds, pitching two hearts. And then try and make an educated guess. So let's give this a shot. King of clubs there. Queen of spades. Heart discard. East did have a doubleton there. Um, and another heart. Okay, and they covered. Um, still have a heart loser here. So that one was exactly 50%. Wow. Does. Like, the robot always covers it. Ah, oh, stiff queen. <laughs> How boring is that? Like, I thought that maybe I'd work to guess here. Um, but yeah, I guess East had Dalton Diamond, Dalton Spade. Yeah. Completely flat. So, running at 42%. Two hearts, two spades, three hearts. Here I've got 14 points. King of Hearts is a stopper, but I've only got one. I reckon playing in spades is probably better than uh, in no trumps, because in no trumps, they go heart, heart, I win. We get five diamond tricks. We need to take the rest of the tricks. So let's try four spades. Okay. I don't want to get tapped out. So King of Hearts would be a bad play. Wow. Three, seven, ace. Okay. So club switch, eight of clubs. So we'll now play a low spade. And another club. And we just draw trumps at this stage. And we have the rest of the tricks, so making 11 uh, plus 1 should be a good board. 75%. Yeah, 3 no trumps, not a good spot, as you can see. Um, so I have one heart stopper, but because we need to run 9 tricks straight away, my doubleton 10 of spades seems decent there. 3 spades, far too weak here. 5, like, bidding 4 diamonds. Removes 3 no trumps. Partner... Could bid four spades, but if they don't do that, you're in some trouble. So I just like jumping to four spades here, as uh, which which spot you want to play in. Anyway, uh, back above 50, so that's good. Board five, we've got a balanced 13 count. We'll open one diamond, three spades, swish. Too weak to bid anything over that. So four of clubs lead, dummy came comes down with 10 points. I've got 13, so that's 23, 17 missing. 
Um, probably evenly split. I don't think West is that strong. Um, my partner hasn't underlet an ace, but I should still put in the king. Okay, uh, four of clubs. So my partner's only got a four card club suit. And I want them to cash the ace of diamonds. So it looks like my partner has a the queen of clubs, probably. Um, West doesn't. My, my partner has a spade on her here, which is almost certainly the ace. West doesn't have ace-queen to whatever in spades, because otherwise they'd take a finesse. Um, so, uh, my partner has a spade on her, and if it was the queen, they would be hopping up with the queen there. So my partner has the ace of spades, nothing in hearts. Looks like West has a queen, ten, nine to seven spades, the ace of clubs. I don't know about the diamonds. I could play diamonds to be uh, four triple three and like lead a low diamond. Uh, they've got. Um, I could try a low club here, but maybe my partner is afraid to lead away from their king of diamonds. I could try cashing my ace of diamonds. Partner led a low club rather than um, leading a diamond. The robots really like passive leads, so my partner probably has a diamond here. So I could try switching a low diamond. Um, my partner's got three or four clubs. West has the ace. So I've got like ace, queen, jack. That's possible, but even still it doesn't look like my partner's lead was that passive. Unless they have precisely ace, queen, jack type. Um... Right. I don't want them, to, like, if they've got a stiff heart, they would have taken those two pitches straight away. So they don't have a stiff heart. They've only got one entry to the spades with the jack of spades. So not in a rush here, so let's just play a club. There's the ace of spades. And a club. Okay, uh, so West has three clubs, seven spades, so um, if they had three diamonds then they would have had a singleton heart and taken those tricks already, so just catch the ace. Um, yeah, so that, they've, got, uh, they've got the rest of the tricks. They've got a doubleton heart and just trumps. 50%. Flat board. Um, okay, so here I've got a balanced 13 count. Just open a club. Speed, no trump. Four spades. Alright. So, heart lead. So we have a heart loser and two club losers. Looks like I just need to guess the clubs. I could try something like playing a low heart, hoping he's led away from the jack. That would set up a heart for a discard. Um, that seems a bit much. So let's just put in the king. And I just have to guess this straight up. Uh, so we've got ten spades. Uh, it looks like East has four hearts, West has four hearts. Um, they can see my Jack fourth club. Would the robots be underleading aces here? That could be into a singleton king. I don't think that they will, so let's just put in the ten. They were both offside. Okay, so we got the rest of the tricks here. For well, not fifty-three percent. Like, check this out. These like flat board extraordinaire should have been flat. This one should be flat, but. 
Past a spade. Oh, yeah, using the information that it's the best hand tournament, notice that they've only got this 4 triple 3 13, weren't interested, hit their partner with the nuts, and got punished. Okay, uh, next I have a triple four one thirteen count, so I'll open a diamond, two spades, pass pass, I'll reopen with a double. Or not. Feature. I re like, I really dislike this method of this is a feature. Like, what what is a feature? Is the feature like a singleton? Or is it strictly, I have some high card points here? I really like showing shortages. It's a lot easier for partner to judge what to do opposite this. If a feature can be both points or shortage is really bad. And they get to four spades. So I've got 13. West is a weak jump. East has an artificial four, so they've got some, they've got a shortage here. Because they don't have that. Um, their shortage probably is in diamonds rather than that. Because West has a feature. Uh, so with hearts sitting over them. Should I try doubling them? No. Too rich for my blood. Okay. Queen of diamonds. So I have 13. Dummy's got 12. Um, so that's 25, 15 missing. Uh, West has, let's say, 10. Uh, my partner's got 5 points. This looks like I need to switch to hearts before the club's set up. So, king of hearts, there's the 10. Low club lead, so West doesn't have, like, they could have a singleton club. I'd like to know if uh, three club, they would bid three clubs with a singleton, but... Um, okay, so if they do have a singleton club, they don't have that many entries back to the hand. Uh, so if they've only got six spades, then... I think I can afford to duck this. Another diamond, which my partner dropped the jack. They have no idea about the 10, so it looks like West is a 6 4. Okay, so we get that. Cash the Queen of Hearts. And Club. They're rough in there. Couple more spades, 53%. Okay, so what happens if I don't duck? So if I, let's just have a look at this. Diamond, king of hearts switch has to be right. And if they lead a low club. Okay, so low club and now they're still down two. If I take the ace, then they have uh, two pitches for both their diamonds, so they get to go like uh, king of spades, club, club, pitching both their diamonds, and then at this stage they would lose a heart, a club, two spades, and a diamond for the same down two, so that really didn't matter. All roads lead to Rome. Two spades. Ah, oh, they opened one club and then passed it out. If you open one diamond, you get the opponents to bid on. It's kind of funny. <laughs> uh, if it went one club, uh, two spades, pass, pass to me, I would be reopening with a double here. Um, so again, another very flat board. A, a massive score of 51%. And then... Pass a diamond, a spade, and I have a trap pass here, so let's make a trap pass. Partner, you're meant to reopen a double, just like 
Double. Double. All right, so that looks like we're playing three new Trump here. Um, like... What on earth? 18 to 22 total points. Strong rebittable diamonds. Um, Alright. 13 points my partner has. And probably a 7-4. With a void spade. Um... I guess I should pass this, or should I convert this to 6 no? Uh, um, well, if my partner's got like a singleton heart, I should be playing in diamonds, so I'll pass. Okay. Um... Well, I need them to crash their honours. So what's the best way of doing that? Hmm. So let's put in the jack of clubs. And... Playing a diamond towards the hand. I want West to fly with the ace, with ace fourth, and try and give their partner a rough. Okay. Well, that's disappointing. Okay, so at this stage, we just rough and queen of diamonds. They <laughs> had the ace king of diamonds. Um. So down one. Fifty-three percent. Wow, everyone was in there. Um, yeah, I thought maybe some people might bid immediately with my hand. I do agree my partner shouldn't reopen with a double with a seven five. Um, and all they really need me to have is one honor and diamond. So I'm, I don't actually mind their six diamond bid. There's no good way them to find out do I have the ace or king of diamonds so it seems reasonable just to give that a shot uh, six no trumps is a terrible spot <laughs> um, goes down a lot more so I'm glad I didn't bid that but I finished with a healthy 51.8 percent in equal fifth um, the only bad board I had was two spades, uh, four hearts, where I overcalled a no trump, which I think is reasonable. The opponents then got to hearts, and that just sort of makes 11. I could have led my stiff spade, maybe held it back there. And my oh, the only other board that really mattered, I guess, was where we got to four spades, where you raise with the doubleton. So, equal fifth, 51.8%. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this very, very flat weekly free instant tournament, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.